<laughs> we are at the bus station. Take two. <laughs> Bought our ticket this morning. It's 9.30 in the morning. We leave at 10 and uh, we'll be on our way. Simple, simple. So far. <laughs> you say? I always have to let a caveat. That's right. I Curse us. <laughs> hey, no, it's, I'm uncursing you. Because if I said, hey, it's perfect, then if something happened, but no, if you say, so far, that means that you're allowing. Okay, never mind. I'm if, just anybody's, talk to if anybody's tracking that, please let us know. And if you haven't subscribed, please just click the subscribe button and the little bell next to it. Uh, we're really trying to grow our channel and make it self supporting. We don't make really any money off of it, we're trying to pay our costs on like the software and stuff. So that would be greatly appreciated. And if you like it, please share with all your friends. And I need to stop looking here and look there because you That's all right. are here. I not was there. doing the exact same thing this time. <laughs> I kept noticing it tracking on my eye. I'm like, I'm like oh, look. Oh, look at, look at, here we are. Wait, 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 like there, no background. No. Face? There. No background. We might not have gotten enough sleep last night. Oh, that's true. We'll talk to you from Skopje. Where do we go from? Where do we go from here? Just got off the burst and M supposed to have great burgers. What's a burst? I doubt that. After a two hour bus ride with a guy that's chain smoking driver. Talks only. And I'm sitting right behind him. Whew. <laughs> My throat's a little, yeah, it was special right. But I just noticed next door they have donuts, so we may have to do that afterwards. Wow, I can smell the burgers and they smell absolutely amazing. Oh, it's the big man. Oh, with Katie Rock and the double patty special. That is messy, but that is really good. Two smashed hamburgers, real hamburger, with pickles, fry sauce, lots of cheese, and the bun it tastes like it's homemade. This is really good. Mm, those are good fries. This is the baconator. Mm, the bacon is really crispy. Fry sauce. Something's a little spicy. Chili aioli. Oh, that's that's really good. Oh, these are amazing. If you ever need a burger and you're in Skopje, come to M Burger. Just M's. Plain M. <laughs> these are about $5 a piece. Sorry, Lance. We haven't found a Big Mac in a while, so this is just going to have to tide you over. Stefan, thank you. Thank you too. Well, now that we've gotten that taken care of, welcome to Skopje, North Macedonia. It looks like Skopje, but it's pronounced Skopje or something very similar to that. All of learned how to say thank you in the local language. It's Blagoduro. We found that it's April 1st, so all the kids... Well, speaking of... Yeah, all the kids dress up on April 1st. It's pretty cool. This is our apartment in Skopje. Let's see. Oh yeah, I can do some exfoliating with these towels. That's just nice. But the best part, oh wait, forgot the kitchen in the other part. Bathroom, a washing machine, kitchen, has everything you need. But my favorite part, oh, oh as Chris backs into the wall, is out here. Check out this view. And you can see the river. And all of this, for $40 a night. Today I've decided that I'm gonna do two things. Push my comfort zone and do a bucket list thing. So I'm going to a hairdresser in a country I don't speak the language and having something really interesting done to my hair. Ready as I'm gonna be. <laughs> my hair done as you can see it was amazing it took four hours and the process I've never had anything done like it but I love it thank you so much to Sophia and Alex I love every minute of it this place was amazing we have been at the salon for four hours I did slip over to the market where I was surprised to find that Texas Cola is only available in small bottles you know that wow it is time to get some food and I've got some special plans but while we're on the way to whatever Kate's got planned for food, we will just enjoy some of the views around this city. Skopje was definitely a surprise when we rolled into town. I had no idea just how much cool stuff there was scattered all over the city. My mind still boggled from my hair appointment. I'm sorry, I'm not all here at the moment. <laughs> sorry, we'll get some food. 
As we made our way towards the bazaar, I couldn't help feeling that we were walking through some sort of ancient history theme park. This area has been continuously inhabited since around 4000 BC, and the designers of the city have done their best to pay homage to every phase of their development in history. Well, totally by mistake, we wandered down and found this awesome little shopping street. We're on our way to the bazaar, which is where Kate's taking us to eat lunch. The smells around here making me hungry. <laughs> we might not make it to the bazaar if we keep passing places that smell this good. We've only been here a little bit, but I can already tell you, if you haven't come to Skopje, you should put it on your list. It's amazing. It's so walkable, too, and people are so sweet. I think this is the largest selection of monuments that we've seen outside of Rome. Yeah. We're wandering around looking for the bazaar, but apparently we're in it. <laughs> this is the place. Well, I don't exactly remember why I picked this place. I think I heard it from somebody. I put it on my Google Maps that said it was a good place, the Aviar. So this is chai, not chai tea, because this is the name of tea, it's chai. Mm, that's very good. I'm terrible, it tastes like black tea. Does it have sugar in it already? No. Ha, I was looking for something to start with. It's right there. That's good. One of my old jobs, I was required to drink a whole lot of this, but it was always pretty sweet and they dumped a ton of sugar in it while they cook it. This is nice, you get to choose your sweetness level. Smoked chicken pita. It really smells smoked. Fresh baked bread, cheese, smoked chicken. It is really good. That place was was good. I'm not sure that I would recommend it only because I had the smoked chicken and it was so smoked and so salty that I could barely eat it. We don't mind salty stuff. That was even a little bit much for me. Mine was good. It was cheese, but that those things were like six bucks a piece. So bang for the buck, definitely no. not there. No. Now we're gonna go look for something else to eat. <laughs> I believe, since I've been watching a lot of videos, these are called Turkish delights, but I am not sure. Alexander the Great. Thank you. It is enormous. Apparently there's been quite a bit of strife between North Macedonia and Greece over the past few decades regarding things such as Alexander the Great and even the name of the country and their flag. We've heard a little bit about it, but if anybody knows some more, please feel free to enlighten us in the comments. to see Mother Teresa's house. We were gonna come down here yesterday. Well, we got distracted by that place. <laughs> Not gonna lie, that was a really good distraction. I'd go there again. How could a place called the Chaco house go wrong? <laughs> We'll look for a little more information on that. I think it's just a memorial. I thought it was at the site of her house where she was from, but I'm not really sure. It's set up chronologically to Mother Teresa's life. You start here and you go around. This 
is not Mother Teresa's old house. Her old house is on the square. It was leveled in the earthquake back in the early 1900s. There's now a plaque there that shows where her house was. This was, however, the church where she was baptized when she was one day old and also where she first heard her calling to service. This church was also leveled during the earthquake. They put the shrine here to Mother Teresa, St. Teresa, and they have a little chapel upstairs. And the Pope came here and blessed it. In 2019. For this thing behind us, also, that I don't know what it's called, but I'll put it in. <laughs> we are really good at researching. We're expert researchers on this trip. <laughs> but uh, it is really gorgeous. Now we're on the search for lunch. Go figure. <laughs> no idea what this place is, but it looks really cool. So it looks like it might be closed. We can't find the place, so we're just gonna have to look someplace else and not get rained on. <laughs> we came to a local place. They have beans, a chopped salad. It has a really, really salty cheese. It goes really good together. Meat, uh, pepper, onions, and bread. This is a lot of food. <laughs> that pepper was really good. It's uh, roasted and it's not hot at all. Let's try these beans. They're really light, they don't have a lot of flavor. Could use a little salt. These are good. Good ma'am. A little greasy. A little pinch. Yeah. Keep drinking this coffee. <laughs> Make the thumbs up and subscribe. Oh, no, that was good. That was good. That was good. <laughs>